So guys, for the first method, you're gonna head over to search and type in check for updates. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna click on check for updates. Make sure that your computer is fully up to date. And now you're gonna scroll down and then click on advanced options. And then once this comes up, you're gonna scroll down again and then click on optional updates. Now you may be seeing the HID compliant touch driver update right over here. So if you do see it here, then you're gonna click on it and then click on download and install. For the second method, you're gonna head over to search again and type in device manager. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna expand human interface devices. And now you want to right click on human interface devices and then click on scan folder changes. And then after you've done that, it might appear in this list. See if that works for you. For the next method, you wanna head over to search and type in CMD. Now you want to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. And then once you're on this, you wanna type in msdt.exe space dash id space device diagnostic. Click on enter. And now this will come up. You wanna click on next. Wait for this to load. And now once this comes up, you just wanna go through these steps. So I'm gonna click on I don't see my device listed. Wait for this to load. When this comes up, you wanna click on enable. Wait for this to load. And then once troubleshooting has completed, hopefully this will not fix your problem. And now for the last method, just try doing a restart of your computer. See if that works for you. 